Hello everyone, it's Cleo here, and today I have something all new to show you. Before we begin, for the eagle-eyed among you, yes, this is a different little pet shop to my usual mascot. I just seem to have temporarily misplaced her. I'm not replacing her, I have just misplaced her for now, but I'll find her soon. Yeah, okay, let's, let's go with the show. You know those reproduction LPS that technically aren't fakes of the original Little's Pet Shop designs, but original designs on the old mold, so the kind of fake LPS and the kind of original LPS at the same time? You know those Little's Pet Shops? Well, I did a video on one of the collies, but now they are also making Great Danes, so today I'm going to be showing you the two new Great Danes they have. Here is everything I've got, some accessories here, and here are the two Little's Pet Shops. Let's open up this one first. Ta-da! This is a totally original design, which I believe the seller was calling the Cow Great Dane for its splotches. This is a really unusual design. I don't think Hasbro ever did anything quite like this with little freckles and splotches and little kind of eyebrow markings, as I call them. He has got a condition called heterochromia, which means when two eyes are two different colours, that is the official name for it, the condition. And it's a real thing with some people in the world. Not off the world though, because we don't know much about aliens. Got a little splodger on his ear though, which kind of looks like a little braid to me. I don't know why, it just looks like a little braid in his ear. Little freckles, splodgers, splodger on his butt, splodger on his legs. They're kind of uh, symmetrical actually, the splodgers on his legs. I just noticed that they're like little booties. But he's cute, he's got a pretty unique eye design to the, uh, in the oval. I'll explain to you with the other Great Dane the difference I mean, but this is printed in a different way because it's designed a bit differently, but I have no problem with that. It's just, just a note. Despite the fact that he's fake, he really does feel like, uh, well, a real LPS. He doesn't feel any different to me. The eyes, I think, are a little different. They didn't make them quite like that. But if you didn't know, you wouldn't know if you know what I mean. His bobble works really well as well. It just kind of spins a bit. So I guess it's another thing that would give it away a bit, that there's something a bit different about him. Then we have the second one and my favorite one. Okay, this one is definitely a girl in my mind, and she has such a pretty design. Look, it's the same color as you can see here. It's really not much difference, but the difference in the face makes, well, all the difference. She has just beige splotches, and in fact, I just noticed they have the same little booties going on pretty much on the legs. Look, there is not much difference on those. I didn't even notice that when I bought them. It's kind of cute, actually. They should be brother and sister, for sure. She's got just blue eyes. They're really light and icy. Little splotches here, pink on the inside of her ears instead of white, and stars in their eyes. She's cute. The same thing, the head kind of spins around, but that's fine because you know what? The new LPS do that anyway, and I mean the newest official ones. But as I was saying, you see how the eyes are kind of drawn differently? You can see most of the iris in this one. This one's much larger, just to know. And you know, the interesting part about these little pet shops was they were designed by fans on Instagram. It was a competition going, and these were the lucky winners to have their designs turned into actual toys. How exciting is that? They've also included a couple of accessories in this pretty little bag for me. We've got a little hair dryer. Remember back in the days when people used to do sound effects with their mouths? And then we have the best accessory ever, a pair of glasses, which I always say, a pair of glasses makes anyone or anything a lot cuter than it originally was. So I'm going to try it on this little guy to prove the point. But yes, he's a lot cuter now. Thank you. Look at him, 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 look at him. If you are interested in buying these for yourself, the link is in the description below. I would recommend them. They are pretty much like real LPS. There's not much difference between those two and this one in my hand right now. So if you are watching this, people selling these, when are you going to start making fake spaniels? I'd be all over those. So let me know in the comments what you think to these two cuties. I think they are super adorable. It's nice to see old LPS kind of coming back to life in this new fake form. If you enjoyed this video, do not forget to give it a like and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching.